Oh my days. Oh my god, what a finish! Welcome to the first Group E clash with second biggest favourites to win the tournament, South Korea facing Bahrain. We head to a new stadium today, Jasim Bin Hamad, a ground not used at the World Cup. South Korea won the first two tournaments when the competition began, but now seem to be cursed. Reaching four finals, losing every single one of them. But with their new crop of players, the likes of Wang Ki Chan and Hyun Ming Sun, they're not bottlers. Whilst Kim Min Jae and Lee Kang In at Bayern and PSG both smashing it too. Tottenham legend Jurgen Klinsmann, the gaffer, needs to win the Korean fans back by making them triumphant. And it all begins again. Bahrain, who are currently FIFA ranked 86. They qualified by beating Yemen 2 0 to keep them second above them and Nepal. Into the tunnel we go, the Bahrain team with their final warm ups go back into the dressing room right in front of us. You know, you've got to say hello to Sun. You're going to say hello, yeah? <laughs> He's the goat man from England. I watch him at Tottenham. Everybody loves him. How can you not love Young Min Sun? Nicest footballer in the world. Here come the players for Korea, the dressing room on the left. My job today is simple. I'm going to bless the South Korea team to win the match. Now, if you didn't know, I watched them at the World Cup and they weren't as good as they really wanted to be. Kyung Min Son just came back from an injury. Klinsman was, uh, yeah, he, he wants to do better in Qatar. And this time round, they're one of the favorites to win the tournament. So I'm going to catch eye contact with Kyung Min Son and that will bring the luck. Let's see if we can do it. Who's going to score? Son. Son. Two. Son. <laughs> there he is. Young Min Son, right in front of us. A 10,000 capacity stadium. And the South Korea team are about to walk out for the first game in the Asian Cup. He's a leader. Wow, Son, Son, the captain, firing up the players. He's shouting at them as they go out. He's made captain of Tottenham this year. And here they come entering the field, where we're going to switch to my cameraman Cassius as they walk out. Here's our seat today, we're going to get a suntan. The South Korean fans are around us. It's a lovely small stadium, the weather is perfect. Oh. Ball to Bahrain. Bahrain fans fired up over there. So, against the odds, early chance. Oh. I'll tell you what, the support around us, and there's a chance missed for Bahrain. All the Koreans around us love it. Park got a yellow card there. It's all happening in front of us at Al so, I knew I was coming to Korea, so uh, I've learned some phrases. And Google, a little guy, means uh, come on Korea. I probably said it completely wrong there. Another booking for the Korean players, look at this. <laughs> the fan base is fuming. Two bookings, honestly. Bahrain are catching them on the counter. Korea getting a bit, a bit angry on the pitch here. Sonny! It's like, it's like watching football at Craven Cottage here. But the Qatari version. You can literally shout to the players and they are hearing. They are hearing, look, here's Lee. Come on, Lee! Come on, Lee! Who said the Asian Cup wouldn't have fans? South Korea. Going right up the rankings here. Attacks on. Jung Min Son. What can he do? I mean, if I was a footballer trying to, to play when I got that many squeals every time I touch the ball, I'd probably have zero goals in 20 games. Oh my god! Diving header there. Wasn't Son. It's South Korean knocking on the door. Kim Min Jae, the buying centre back, drives forward. The fans go wild. Oh, space here for Jae Sung Lee. Park! Oh, he sends it into the local park in Doha. Right, really funny. Look who's in, Jung Min Son. Oh. Let that man cook and he will deliver. Chance here for South Korea. No, no, no. You don't miss them. How do you miss that? Cho has had a mare. It's the, it's the headband. Bad luck, I know it. Every time there's a foul, the referee has been against Korea today. Cassius, the editor, loving it. He won't be loving it for much longer because here come Bahrain. How did you miss that? Oh, his son, it's Sonny. Honestly, in terms of fan girling, fan boying, whatever you want to call it, here comes Son. 
Bahrain defended again. Great play here. What a chance. Anywhere but the goalie. Exactly what that means. A vital three points match day one in the Asian Cup. They could build on that and they've got the support. Wang scores. Red Star Belgrade, good builder. He's done brilliant there. Took his moment. Now we need one from Sonny. Sonny. Free kick given. The number seven. Tottenham's captain. Korea's captain. Or will it be Lee Kang in? The whistle was blown. Sun goes over it. Lee Kang in. Oh, so close. Quality in this team, you can feel it. That's half time here. South Korea lead 1 0. Many yellow cards. Challenges flying. And a new stadium, which I really enjoy. South Korean fans come past so far. We'll do the ranking at the end, but it might be up there with Iran in India. See. The boys are back in town for the second half. If it was my decision, Wang Ki Chan on the field. But I'm not I'm not Jurgen Klinsman, so let's see what he does. And here come Bahrain. They've really, I mean we haven't spoken about it enough. They've done a very good job. A very good job. Should have scored as well. For a nation, let's just put it on the map now. Smaller than Qatar. You know. How many places below South Korea as well? They're fighting. Bahrain kickers off for the second half. Support for Bahrain behind the goal there. The flags are out. It's good football for Bahrain. They've done it! Bahrain have scored! There's no way. I don't believe this. One of the smallest nations in this competition have shocked the world. I did not expect that. They looked like they were coming back into it more and more. The first half they were unlucky, the second half they were clinical. 1-1 one, one here, but all respect goes to these players. They kept pushing, they got their moment and they took it. And these fans behind are loving it. What is Hyun Min Son thinking now? Second half, 1-1. One, one. Great football here. Lee. Hang in Lee for PSG. What can he do? Beats two. Crosses it in. To Son. Oh, that is the prime duo. That's what Korea fans want to see more of. It's still 1-1. One, one. The Bahrainians, loud and proud in Qatar. the finish. Bahrain, they came close, but South Korea were too clinical. Lee Kang in, PSG's finest. <laughs> Wearing the PSG shirts all over. These fans love him, and that's why he delivers 56 minutes 2-1. Now Korea are looking to kill off this game. To the back post. Oh. Son. Oh, off the bar. There he is, the goal scorer. The boy best friends with Neymar. I wonder if he's just watched his goal. That was one from his textbook. Even on the field, Son is giving tips to his teammates. It's amazing, he's such a captain now. Surely a goal here for Korea. <laughs> These fans love it. Fourth goal of the game. Taking over Qatar. Really good finish. I think it was Kim. Pangin Lee with his second goal on the right side. His sweet left foot. That's why Paris signed him. They knew his talent. And now he's cooking at the Asian Cup. 3-1. Game over. Korea, one of the big favourites. I'm telling you. That's the man of the match right there. Wow. He is so good. 
Oh my God. He's got Sonny in here. Surely. No. Sonny. Sonny would have been the perfect end. It would have been one assist and two goals for Canyon Lee as well. 74th minute, still 3 1. Son Hyung Min. He's a bummer, right? Oh my god. Oh my days. He's seriously kicking. The Korean Messi. And they might score from it as well. Oh! No, no, no. He's the Korean Messi. Left footed plays the same way. We are watching the next Messi of this generation, I swear. Kangin Lee scores many Mogpoyo. Two Mogpoyo today, maybe three. If we're ranking the fans, I'm not putting career top, but they've definitely got the most female fans, which is great to see they travel for the team. And do you know what? They come in numbers. They come in numbers. I'll probably give them third after India and Iran. Jungmin Son to win it! Oh my god, no. What does he need to do to score? We've got a Tottenham fan here. You've cursed him. You've cursed him. <laughs> two chances now. I swear if he's in a Tottenham show, he puts four goals from those two chances. Some PSG fans have been labelling him as a flop. They need to get him back in the 11 immediately. This is an opportunity for him to show him what he can do, and he is certainly doing that. We're going to three games today, so we have to run off to Indonesia, Iraq, but South Korea have been dominant. I don't know if there's going to be one more goal from this corner, but they don't need it. They've proven to me. Kung Min Son, Lee Kang In. Those two players on each wing, too strong for this competition. I think they can go all the way. I'd put them in the final at least. Smash the like for South Korea. Thank you for watching. Lee Kang In. Get into the Premier League.